Bainbridge is a fully integrated family of real estate companies who have developed and acquired more than 43,000 units representing $7.5 billion in transactions since inception. With over 650 associates nationally, Bainbridge engages in virtually every step of the real estate process, from development and construction, acquisition and disposition, to asset management and third-party property management of multifamily real estate Bainbridge is the 10th largest multifamily developer and the 14th largest multifamily builder in the United States. Our team of experienced and knowledgeable professionals is devoted to creating exceptional living experiences for all of our residents and building lasting, mutually beneficial relationships with our partners and clients. To learn more, visit www.bainbridgecompanies.com. Having been a rider, and showing on the East Coast in the Hunter Jumper Worlds on the A Circuit, coupled with my experience as an insurance professional with 30 years in the industry, I'm the lucky one that gets to marry my career with my passion. And at Flagler, I get the resources that I really need to do my job as best as possible. I'm Missy Sullivan, the director of the equine division at Flagler Insurance, and I look forward to helping all of you with your insurance needs. There's a gentler side of Florida, just waiting for you to discover it. Where America's first resort destination was built and genuine hospitality began. A place with cleaner sands, warmer waters, and fewer crowds. A place different than the rest. One that exceeds, excels, and surpasses all expectation. Waiting here just for you. We are the original, the one, the only, the Palm Beaches. It's a feeling of trust, flying, and having the freedom to overcome any obstacle together. Valley Vet Supply is here for it all. Fulfilling my life's legacy, greatest passions, and orders fast. What you think, you become. What you feel, you attract. What you imagine, you create. Zen Elite Equestrian Center. Come pursue your equestrian goals from grassroots to top sport. Equestrian dreams thrive in our soul-soothing surroundings that nurture the mind, body, and spirit of both horse and rider. This is Zen. Hi, I'm Dr. Strathman here at All Paws Animal Clinic, and our team wants to welcome you and your pet to our hospital. All Paws has been in the community for more than 20 years. We offer a full range of services to help keep your pet healthy and happy ranging from preventive care options like our popular dental cleaning services and annual exams to consults for your pet's allergy-prone skin, geriatric conditions, and ultrasound and x-ray evaluation. Are you ready to take that next step in your pet's health with us? We look forward to seeing you soon.
my first goal when I decided to be a professional is to become like the best horsewoman I can be. Uh, it's really important for me to find the balance with my family, with the horses and with my passion, work with uh, the horses every day to do what I love. Yeah. I used to have like one passion was the horses yeah. and now I have two with my daughter. So I really want to have this balance in my life. I'm Marie Eckhart, I'm a professional show jumper representing France and I'm Lola's mom. Be mindful, be present, turn on your brain. At Deaver Golf Cars, we bring excitement to your golf car experience. We have an extensive range of new and refurbished inventory, and our team will fulfill all your sales, service, and rental needs. Whether you're teeing it up on the course, cruising through the neighborhood, or at the campground with family and friends, we have options to fit each and every lifestyle. Experience the Deaver difference, built on a tradition of excellence and service since 1978. Wine Pack and Nutritionals is your one-stop shop for all of your stable and veterinary needs. As the official sports healthcare supplier of the Winter Equestrian Festival, we invite you to stop by and take advantage of our extensive inventory, discount prices, and unparalleled customer service. You can also shop on our website, www.equinean.com, or stop by our store in Coconut Creek, Florida. You can also be reached at one 800 horse, the ultimate athlete, the best friend, the teammate. Once wild, they now place their unquestioning trust in us. At Keyflow, we hold a deep appreciation that horses choose to grant us humans the privilege to keep and to care for them. We knew horse feed could be better, so we made it better. Better for those who need power and endurance to fuel performance. Better for those who need the best start in life to reach their potential. Better for those who need the vitality to tackle new adventures. And better for those who seek longevity because they have more wisdom yet to share. Through science and innovation, we've developed a range of feeds that are easier for horses to digest, that deliver more nutrients, and that require lower feeding rates. Keyflow Feeds, redefining equine nutrition because horses rely on us.
15 minute call, 15 minutes for the first stone course. Get the jump on the competition and see the Omega Alpha difference in your horse. The natural herbal formulas from Omega Alpha are proven safe and effective manufactured to the highest pharmaceutical grade standards in our ontario headquarters every omega alpha product delivers great results visit omegaalpha.com every day we get up with one thing on our minds taking care of the horses we love safe choice continues to be your trusted partner in their overall nutrition supporting a healthy body shiny coat and strong top line. And now with Digestive Shield, it supports your horse's gut health and immune system even more, so they look and feel their best. Safe choice, now with Digestive Shield. Shield your horse from the inside out. The horse, the ultimate athlete, the best friend, the teammate. Once wild, they now place their unquestioning trust in us in the ring, on the track, and in the field. At Keyflow, we hold a deep appreciation that horses choose to grant us humans the privilege to keep and to care for them. This sense of responsibility drives everything we do. We know that through health comes performance, so if we want their best, we've got to give them ours. Our mission to redefine equine nutrition began because there was a clear gap between what was available and what we knew was possible. We knew horse feed could be better, so we made it better. Better for those who need power and endurance to fuel performance. Better for those who need the best start in life to reach their potential. Better for those who seek marginal gains to reign supreme. Better for those who need the vitality to tackle new adventures and better for those who seek longevity because they have more wisdom yet to share. Through science and innovation, we've developed a range of feeds that are easier for horses to digest, that deliver more nutrients, and that require lower feeding rates. We've engineered each steam extruded nugget, pallet, cooked grain, and drop of oil for the health of the horse. So with every feed, you can trust that you're doing your very best for them. Keyflow feeds, redefining equine nutrition, because horses rely on us. A 10 minute call for the top of the order. 10 minutes for the first stone course.
Chuck, Chuck, one, two, three. Just under five minutes away from the first dog course and today's $140,000 CSI three-star Grand Prix presented by the Bainbridge Companies. Proud to be a sponsor of the 2024 Equestrian Sport Productions Annual Show Series. And based here in Wellington, Florida with offices in Orlando, Tampa, Washington, D.C., Charlotte, Raleigh, Atlanta, Dallas, and Austin. Bainbridge is one of the nation's premier owners, developers, builders, and managers of multifamily real estate. We'll see 45 in round one of competition this morning for our $140,000 CSI Star Grand Prix. Course description today sponsored by Palm Beach County Sports Commission. And the course will begin in the tiki corner of the ring at the Zen Elite Equestrian Oxer at one, jumping towards the VIP tent side of the ring. Left hand turn around the palm tree to the wall at two. The drinking horse Oxer at three comes up next with the light blue rails. Turning right to the vertical at four, the palm tree vertical with the water tray underneath, and then the first combination comes up at five, uh, palm tree double Oxer to a vertical there. Right hand turn around the hedges it to the horse where Ireland at triple bar at six, and bending left to the Palm Beach Equine Clinic vertical at seven with the plank on top, and the Florida Coast Equipment Oxer at eight. Landing after eight, turning right to, to the multicolored pillars with the yellow rails at nine, and then a right-hand turn around the pond to the free jump USA vertical at 10. Key flow feeds USA Oxer at 11 with the red rails and the liver pull underneath and the Bainbridge Company's triple combination uh, at 12 there, vertical Oxer, vertical triple combination, and then finishing over the black and white horse head Oxer with the mafia rails at 13. 16, jumping up for his 13 numbered fences over the first round course with a time allowed of 81 seconds for today's $140,000 Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Catsy Cruz, our course designer on the grass this week. Judging panel being headed by President Kevin Giblin, our foreign judge, Diana Ficini, and completing the panel, Julie Castle and Ralph Alfano. Sarmiento Show Service is taking care of timing and AJ Holmes, the paddock master here at the International Arena. We're just about two minutes away from the top of the order. We're the first of our 45 horse and rider combinations to join us on the Derby field this morning. We have a live anthem singer with us today. Miss Brittany Bivens here to perform the Star Spangled Banner, a fellow equestrian and dog lover that lives in Royal Palm Beach. This time, ladies and gentlemen, we ask that you rise if you are able and remove cover for the Star Spangled Banner performed ahead of our three-star Grand Prix performed by Brittany Bivens. Twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallant.
Yeah, thanks to Brittany Bivens of Royal Palm Beach uh, performing the Star Spangled Banner ahead of today's uh, three-star Grand Prix, $140,000 competition. Uh, the highlight of this week's FBI action here on the grass. 45 to show in round number one. Out of the order approaching the gate to get us underway. In today's competition presented by the Bainbridge Companies. He won the first round time allowed it. One through 13 for the first round course. 16 jumping efforts. It'll be a U.S. rider to kick things off. First of our 45 this morning, the USA's Grant Sacker with Frida. U.S. rider based in Aiken, South Carolina, owner of his mount as well, the 12 year old Oldenburg Mayor Babalu Duruwe. It's our first of 45 combinations for round one. Fair knockdown, so for Grant Secker and uh, Frida. Uh, for number two at the wall, and a knockdown at the key flow feeds USA Oxer at 11 as well. Score of eight reference times, 75-47 within the 81. <laughs> and Julian Samuel Perot, second rider on course, partnered with his own mount today, David Guetta, 16-year-old the Dutch worm, played about Zento.
7404 reference on there for Samuel yeah. Perot with the David Guetta. Knockdowns at 11. Kiklo feeds USA Oxer and to be at the Bainbridge Company's combination as well for a score of eight for the Chilean. Third in the order this morning, the USA's Michael Walton of Coatesville, Pennsylvania. Showing for the owner, Mia Marano. It's mount as Blues RW. 11-year-old Westphalian by untouched. Michael Walton, Blues RW, our third on course this morning. Finishing with eight, 11 and 12 be the two knockdowns for Michael Walton with Blues RW. Third reference time, 78, 73. First round time allowed will remain at 81 seconds with rider references of 7404, 7547, and 78, 73. Charlie Jacobs on course next. Boston, Massachusetts based rider for the US here with a Jimmy Lee GJB, our fourth entry to get the start for the Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix this morning. Charlie riding for CMJ Sport Horse LLC with a 10 year old about up to date. Eight, the score for Charlie Jacobs with Jimmy Lee, GJB, and for the knockdowns at 9 and 12B, 78-54, the Tom Scorby. Fifth to show for the Bainbridge Company's Grand Prix this morning, Julie Wells with my boy, Bill. You know, the Dutch warm blooded by Grundino and by the Swamble Partners Incorporated. It's our fifth to show, still searching for that first clear here for round one.
Front rail down at 11. The Keeflow feeds USA Oxer for Julie Wells with my boy Bill. They score four with a time of 79.56. Michael Morrissey sixth in the order for the Bainbridge Company's Grand Prix. Piloting Ilton uh, Sanermel, the Belgian sport horse, a 10 year old by Clintissimo Z. Here's Ryder showing under the ownership of Stormridge Capital and Imperial Show Stables. Uh, Michael Morrissey, Ilton Sanermel, our sixth on course, none clear so far. First clear round uh, of the day comes uh, from Michael Morrissey with Hilton Center Mel and our Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix 79 and 39, one clear through the first six. Take us to Ireland's Alork and Gallagher with Copycat, owned by the Lost Lake Farms, Nahomas, Washington. 11 year old Westphalian about Comil Fall. Uh, for the Irishman Lorcan Gallagher, seventh on course, just the one clear there from Michael Morrissey in the previous round with Ilton Center Mel. Score 12 for Lorcan Gallagher with the copycat, uh, the Bainbridge uh, triple combination, or all fault to Kane, 78-73 that time with a score of 12. One clear through the first seven, the USA's Michael Morrissey with Oton Center Mellon by Stormridge Capital and Imperial Show Stables. Ireland's Max Watchman up next in the order eighth with the Kilkenny. It's a 12 year old Irish sport horseback card until 933. Susan Magnier listed as the owner.
Max Watchman killed Kenny, our eighth to show. Second clear round, uh, Ireland's Max Watchman with Kilkenny owned by Susan Magnier. The time 77.25 to clear through the first to eight. The Jose's Michael Morrissey, Ireland's Max Watchman with Kilkenny. Another combination for the Irish is now with Extravaganza Simi. Entry owned by Alexis Boto, Nashville, Tennessee. And you'll just France for the Irish rider, our ninth in the order. The two clear so far, Matt, Michael Morrissey and Max Watchman. That's penalty free, 75-99. Clear out for Christian Coyle with extravaganza, Simi. Three clear in round number one so far through the first nine. And companies of Grand Prix, the USA's of Michael Morrissey, an Irishman, Max Watchman, and Christian Coyle. Penalty free as well. Attempt to receive the tone, U.S. rider Vanessa Hood with Cascarretto. 12-year-old host center by Casal and about take two LLC are tenth in the order, three clear to this point.
75-20, that's three clears in a row as Hood finishes up fault free with take two Scott Scorretto. Gives us four clear through the first 10 here in round one. Lacey Gilbert's in our 11th in the order this morning. U.S. rider from Lake Forest, Illinois with Carlin Van Tevenhoff as our mount for today's three-star Grand Prix presented by the Bainbridge Companies. Carlin, a 14-year-old by Van Thomas de Muse, owned by Seabrook LLC for the USA's Lacey Gilbertson, 11th rider to join us for round one. Just the four faults at A at the Bainbridge triple combination for Lacey Gilbertson and Carlin Van Tevenhoff. Time 76-59. And for Ireland's Dylan Lee is about a 14-year-old uh, Zangers out of Mayor by Shaco Blue. And Double C Stables entry, Cinderella Z. And the Irishmen are 12th to come on course here for round one, four clear to this point. Seventy-eight, twelve, uh, just the four at the free jump USA vertical at ten for Ireland's Dylan Daly with Cinderella Z. Four clear to this point through the first 12 in round one of the $140,000 Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. It's a U.S. rider to join us next on course, uh, Rebecca Conway. 
Yeah, 13 spot in the order this morning. We're going to start nice in Baker Mount. What about the Blue Hill Farm, Salt Lake City. We have an untouchable 27, a 10 year old item for the U.S. rider. Rebecca Conway, our 13th to show again, four clear so far. Just the four at four for Rebecca Conway with Una Sardice and Big Z. Followed by the Blue Hill Farm, Salt Lake City, that time 76 66. <laughs> On floor clear as Great Britain's Amanda Derbyshire comes up in the order with Cornwall BH. British rider listed as the owner of her mount today. Uh, Holsteiner, 16 year old by Con Air. Great Britain's Amanda Derbyshire, Cornwall BH, 14th to show. Free jump vertical at 10, down to four, Amanda Darbyshire into Cornwall BH. Time 77.82 with the four at 10. All right, let's follow Shea now with the squirt gun. 13-year-old Oldenburg by Diorado owned by the eye candy jumpers for the Irishman here, our 15th to show four clear so far.
Yeah, clear round, David Paul O'Shea with squirt gun at 77.30. And fifth combination to qualify for the jump off in today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Third Irishman to qualify, Max Watchman and Christian Coyle also on that clear list, as well as U.S. riders Michael Morrissey and Vanessa Hood. Five fault free through 15, our 16th on course, U.S. rider Alessandra Volpe of Woodside, California. Piloting her own entry, Grand Sion du Pachy, and Belgian sport horse, Batinka's boy. Knocked down an A of the Bainbridge Company's a triple combination for Alessandra Volpi and Grand Chou Time 73 seconds flat. Fastest four falter at this point going into sixth behind the five that are fault free. USA's Alexandra Crown to join us next. Rider from New York, New York uh, with a 13 year old Holsteiner by Diorado. This is it, Dumont and the owner Alexandra Crown for the U.S. Finishing on 16, the time 80.83 for Alexandra Crown with Dumont. Yeah, 
Mechanic Olympian rider on Quadros uh, to show next for the Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Uh, Miami Beach listed as the base uh, for the Colombian rider. He's also the owner of Vermont today, an 11 year old Oldenburg. Uh, Starsky by Stakar. 18th to show, five clear so far. It's Colombia's Andresa Quadros getting the start with her own Starsky. Eighty point fifty three, just the four at eight. Uh, the Florida Coast Equipment odds are down for Andres Quadros and Starsky. Uh, Raleigh Heiler receiving the tone with Boris Chloe. Thirteen-year-old demand by Shot Go Blue, owned by Kurt Heiler of Boston, Massachusetts. The flow feeds the USA Oxer at 11 down. Uh, front rail at 11 for Raleigh Highlander Boris Chloe. The time 80.26 with just the four faults. Another combination for the US is Georgina Bloomberg, uh, 20th in the order this morning with the Casina. 13 year old host Steiner Maryland, but got them Enterprises in New York. 20th the show, five clear so far. Two for the US, three for Ireland.
Cardinals down at 5A and 12B. It's a score of eight to, for Georgina Bloomberg with Casina. Time 76-41. First of three before roller break here in round one of the Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Yes, us run out of Palo Alto, California. Eve Jobs with the hot point to VDL, the 12-year-old uh, Dutch worm led by Tinka's boy for the U.S. owner rider. Down lead over the course at via the Bainbridge Company's triple combination. It's four at 12B for Eve Jobs and Hot Point VDL. The top 79.52. Mm -hmm. Ashley Vogel to join us next with her own Namaste David at Eicheveld. Rider piloting an 11 year old to Belgian sport horse by Elvis Terpuda, 22nd to show five clear at this point in round one of today's Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Yeah, front rail at 12B for Ashley Vogel. It's a score of four board now, Stephen, at Eichevel at the top 78. Thanks. Yeah, final before roller break, uh, Ireland's Dermot Lennon with the Millview sister. Irish owner rider of the 10 year old Irish sport horse by Cicero Z. It's our final before roller break here. And round one holding on five clear at this point.
78-31, it's a clear for Ireland to Dermot Lennon with Millview Cicero. Go ahead into the roller break with its six penalty free so far in round one of today's three-star Grand Prix presented by the Bainbridge Companies. Four for Ireland, Max Watchman, Christian Coyle, Paul O'Shea, Dermot Lennon. Two for the U.S., Michael Morrissey and Vanessa Hood, our six fault-free riders to this point. We have 22 to go after a roller break. Today's $140,000 competition sponsored by the Bainbridge Companies. Proud to be a sponsor of the 2024 Equestrian Sport Productions Annual Series. Based here in Wellington with offices in Orlando, Tampa, Washington, D.C., Charlotte, Raleigh, Atlanta, and Austin. Bainbridge is one of the nation's premier owners, developers, builders, and managers of multifamily real estate. We'll take a few minutes for some ring maintenance. We'll be back underway shortly. 22 still to go in round one, six clear so far. Bainbridge is a fully integrated family of real estate companies who have developed and acquired more than 43,000 units representing $7.5 billion in transactions since inception. With over 650 associates nationally, Bainbridge engages in virtually every step of the real estate process, from development and construction, acquisition and disposition, to asset management and third-party property management of multifamily real estate Bainbridge is the 10th largest multifamily developer and the 14th largest multifamily builder in the United States. Our team of experienced and knowledgeable professionals is devoted to creating exceptional living experiences for all of our residents and building lasting, mutually beneficial relationships with our partners and clients. To learn more, visit www.bainbridgecompanies.com. My first goal when I decided to be a professional is to become like the best horsewoman I can be. Uh, it's really important for me to find the balance with my family, with the horses, that is my passion, work with uh, the horses every day to do what I love. I used to have like one passion was the horses and now I have to, my daughter, so I really want to have this balance in my life. 
I'm Marie Eckhart. I'm a professional show jumper representing France, and I'm Lola's mom. Be mindful, be present, turn on your brain. The horse, the ultimate athlete, the best friend, the teammate. Once wild, they now place their unquestioning trust in us, in the ring, on the track, and in the field. At Kiflo, we hold a deep appreciation that horses choose to grant us humans the privilege to keep and to care for them. This sense of responsibility drives everything we do. We know that through health comes performance. So if we want their best, we've got to give them ours. Our mission to redefine equine nutrition began because there was a clear gap between what was available and what we knew was possible. We knew horse feed could be better, so we made it better. Better for those who need power and endurance to fuel performance. Better for those who need the best start in life to reach their potential. Better for those who seek marginal gains to reign supreme. Better for those who need the vitality to tackle new adventures. And better for those who seek longevity because they have more wisdom yet to share. Through science and innovation, we've developed a range of feeds that are easier for horses to digest, that deliver more nutrients, and that require lower feeding rates. We've engineered each steam extruded nugget pallet, cooked grain, and drop of oil for the health of the horse. So with every feed, you can trust that you're doing your very best for them. Tiflo Feeds, redefining equine nutrition, because horses rely on us. We've seen 23 so far in round one of today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. 22 still remaining in the first round of today's $140,000 competition. Coming out of our roller break, we have five clear, two for the U.S., or correction, six clear, two for the U.S., uh, Michael Morrissey and Vanessa Hood, and four for Ireland, Max Watchman, Christian Coyle, Paul O'Shea, and Dermot Lennon right before our roller break. We'll get back underway with the U.S. rider Bliss Ears, our next show. 24th in the order this morning. You guys are based in Las Vegas, showing for the Bridgeside Farms. Not a nine year old Holsteiner, Christian's Cash by Christian 25.
Plus here is a Christian's cash. Our first to show after the roller break. First of 22 remaining. Six clear at this point. Yeah, for it being the Bainbridge Company's triple combination for Bliss Hears and the Christian's Cash, it's on 78 74 with four at 12 feet. <laughs> 25th to get the start for the Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix, the US rider TJ O'Mara. Runs a New Jersey based to rider showing for Stonehenge Stables, Ocean, New Jersey. Not a 10 year old to Belgium, warm blood. Ona van de Hella for the USA's TJ Ormar, 25th combination to show. Home on 16, the time 75-28 for T.J. Omar with Ona Van de Six clear through 25, 20 still on the first round list for today's Sid Beanbridge Company's Grand Prix. The Brazilian rider to join us next, Victor Mariano Luminati. Today showing under the ownership of MLO Wellington Farm in Lake Worth is about an 11 year old Dutch form blood. Edet by Eldorado Vendez and Shook for Brazil's Victor Mariano Luminati.
Halfway round for Brazil's Victor Mariano Luminati with the Iret 76-31. Seventh competition to qualify for the jump off in today's $140,000 Grand Prix presented by the Bainbridge Companies. Two clear for the U.S., four clear for Ireland, one clear for Brazil. Egyptian rider Nile Nassar up next in the order. This mount of Belgium warm blood by Toulon, the capital Night Star, owned by Evergate Staples. Ball three round, 79-45 uh, for Niall Nassar and the capital night to start. And back to back clears here in round one and eight now on the list for the jump off. It's Colombia's Roberto Tarana uh, for next with DSP Callis and uh, the Colombian rider. It's Mount today, 12 year old uh, Deutsche Sport Horse. I got skinny the second, his own DSP Callis, Colombian Roberto Turin. Does the front rail at the final fence uh, for number 13 uh, for Colombia's Roberto Tarana with his own DSP Callis, time 76-27. Todd <laughs> Minnick is showing next for the Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Not owned by the Lake Worth based Spirit Group. Uh, nine year old Bandarius, a Kickaboo Spirit for the USA's Todd Medicus. Eight clear through the first 28 here in round number one.
Clear round top, Minikas Geekaboo Spirit at 77.58. US Rider becomes our ninth to call up out for the jump off in this afternoon. So $140,000 Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Nine clear through 29, 16 still on the list before we adjust for the jump off. It's a US Rider Hannah Selleck up next, our 30th in the order with Cloud 39, owned by Descanso Farm, Westlake Village, California. Not a 13 year old host, standing by. Cloudy. Penalty free, 73-76. Uh, Hannah Selleck clear with the cloud 39 in round one of today's Bainbridge Company's Grand Prix. Tenth combination to go clear with 15 remaining on the first round list. That'll take us to the USA's Luke Jensen, first of our 15 remaining riders. Competing at today's Grand Prix under the ownership of the West Palm based Wind Farm. Irish Sport Horse, uh, Luke's Mount, ABC Quantum Cruise by Obos Quality. At first to 15 remaining, 10 clear so far. Thank you. Fourteen remaining for round to one. Ten clear to this point, six before the break, four after the roller break. As well as Luis Fernando Lado Sambo joins us on course for the Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Yeah, Venezuela riding part of the, the 14 year old, the Belle de Muse, owned by Jason Young.
70.10 clear for Venezuela's Luis Fernando Larazapo with the 14-year-old Mayor Bell Demuse. 11th combination to qualify for the jump off and today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Mexico represented by our next rider, Eugenio Garza. Now for the Bainbridge Grand Prix, 13-year-old Oldenburg at Contago by Cornelio Valensky, owned by El Milagro. That's a clear for Eugenio Garza and Contago, 77-85, as we now have 12 clear here in round one at the Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. 12 clears, 12 still to show. Uh, U.S. rider Chloe Reed up to a crossover four. <laughs> Team Reed LLC entry for the American, 11-year-old uh, Hanoverian by Cascadello. First of 12 remaining. That's a clear for Chloe Reed and crossover of 4, 75-59. Yeah, Biggers doesn't out the clear list for today's Bainbridge Hit Company's three-star Grand Prix. Thirty-fifth in the order, Laura Kraut with Balu Tenu. Center for our 35th combination, Laura Kraut with Balu Tanu, owned by the St. Bride's Farm, Sarasota. 14-year-old Hanoverian, Bambalu Duruwe.
Yeah, for it be at the Bainbridge Company's triple combination for Laura Crown and Balut Tanu. 76-96 with the four at 12 feet. Yoshrader Elena Haas and the Coast Venaista. Yoshrader piling her own entry for today's three-star competition. 14-year-old the Belgium warm blood by Bremerson Arado. Elena Haas goes for Eister, first of our 10 remaining combinations, 13 clear so far. Our rounds are one and ten. It's a score of eight to top 72.59 for Elena Haas and the Coast Van Eyster. Irishman Jordan Coyle up next in the order. First of our nine remaining riders and uh, the Irishman aboard Ariso for today's competition. Swedish warm blood, a 13-year-old by Casal. Owned by the Alon Farm. Just the Oxer at nine down for Ireland's Jordan Coyle with Ariso on Ballon Farm, 74 88 that time. And yeah, Chile Samuel Perot Jr. with a ride today for Samuel Perot and our Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Uh, the 12-year-old by Verdi T and uh, HFB Versace. And uh, Chilean Samuel Perot Jr., first of eight remaining here in round one.
Score of eight uh, with the knockdowns at three and 12C for Chile SSM Pro Junior with HFB Versace, the time 75-51. Will Simpson now, Ocala based rider for the US uh, and an entry owned by Will Simpson Stables Incorporated. Yeah, the 15 year old Mecklenburg by Shaco Blue. Shaco P for the USA's Will Simpson. First of seven, remaining 13 clear so far. Uh, Will Simpson and Shaco P faulting at the wall uh, for it, number two, 72 81, the time. And the Irishman James Brennan to join us on course next for the Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. James Brennan aboard Rama OL on by Crook Show Jumping. 11 year old to Belgium, one blood by Thunder, that is Utuva. First of six remaining. Uh, four at the wall, four at number 13. It's a score of eight for James Brennan and Arema O.L. It's on 75-78. Five remaining for the first round, holding on 13 clear. Yeah, Mia Bagnato of Fishkill, New York, receiving the tone. First of our five remaining riders. And today partnered with the Valley Oskill Big Bucks, uh, the 11-year-old Irish sport horse by Royal Concord. They're showing for Alon Farm, Newark, New Jersey, first of our five remaining riders.
Clear round, 80.38 for Mia Magnato, Balneot Skill Big Bucks, uh, owned by Lawn Farm, Newark, New Jersey. Your Shredder becomes our 14th on the clear list for today's Bainbridge Companies at three star Grand Prix with four remaining here in round one. In Germany's Rupert Carl Winkelmann now with Galvado's son, uh, the 12 year old owned by Eichendorf Horses. It's the first of our four remaining combinations. Back rail down at the final fence for Germany's Rupert Karl Winkelmann and the Galvado's son, 77-09 with the four at 13. For Lebanon, Jadana showing next with the car OW. The 12-year-old whole center owned by Peter Ford and Laurie Soudreau. First of three remaining. Finishing on four with the knockdown at 5-8 for Lebanon shot Donna and Takaro W. So sounding for the first of two duos here on the first round list for today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix, the U.S. rider Andrew Wills with Idol H&H. &H. 
Dutch Warmblood and 11 year old by Action Breaker. Owned by the Atasca Group and Evergreen Stables. 14 clear, first of two, Andrew Wells with item H&H. &H. Seventy-five is seventy-one. It's a clear out for Andrew Wells with Idol H and H. Fifteenth combination to qualify for the jump off round in today's Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Yeah, final combination for round one. It's our winning a duo. From the qualifier on Friday of this week, Ireland's David O'Brien with El Balu Old, the 12 year old Oldenburg Val Dorado Vendez is shook, owned by the Chansonette and Leap Year Farms. David O'Brien wrapping us up here in round one with El Balu Old. That's a clear 74-25 for Ireland's David O'Brien with El Balu Old, owned by the Chansonette Farm and Leap Year Farm. We'll wrap up round one with 16 clear for today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Hey, coming back for the jump off it this afternoon, Michael Morrissey with Ilton Center Mel, Max Watchman with Kilkenny, Christian Coyle aboard Extravaganza Simi, and Vanessa Hood showing at Cascaretto. Paul O'Shea piloting Squirt Gun. Dermot Lennon partnered with Mildew Cicero. Victor Mariano Luminati aboard Edet. Niall Nassar with Capital Night Star. Tom Minicus and Kikaboo Spirit. Hannah Selleck with Cloud 39. Luis Fernando Larazzabo with Bell de Muse. Eugenio Garza aboard Contago. Chloe Reed with Crossover 4. Mia Bagnano with Balayas Kill Big Bucks. Andrew Wells aboard H. And Friday's winning combination, David O'Brien with El Balu Old.
Rollers are out. Teams making adjustments to the course to prepare for the jump off. 16 to return over the short course in today's $140,000 competition, sponsored by the Bainbridge Companies. Bainbridge Companies proud to be a sponsor of the 2024 Equestrian Sport Productions Annual Show Series, based here in Wellington with offices in Orlando, Tampa, Washington, D.C., Charlotte, Raleigh, Atlanta, Dallas, and Austin. Bainbridge is one of the nation's premier owners, developers, builders, and managers of multifamily real estate. Bainbridge is a fully integrated family of real estate companies who have developed and acquired more than 43,000 units representing $7.5 billion in transactions since inception. With over 650 associates nationally, Bainbridge engages in virtually every step of the real estate process, from development and construction, acquisition and disposition, to asset management and third-party property management of multifamily real estate Bainbridge is the 10th largest multifamily developer and the 14th largest multifamily builder in the United States. Our team of experienced and knowledgeable professionals is devoted to creating exceptional living experiences for all of our residents and building lasting, mutually beneficial relationships with our partners and clients. To learn more, visit www.bainbridgecompanies.com. My first goal when I decided to be a professional is to become like the best horsewoman I can be. Uh, it's really important for me to find the balance with my family, with the horses, that is my passion, work with uh, the horses every day to do what I love. I used to have like one passion was the horses and now I have to my daughter, so I really want to have this balance in my life. I'm Marie Eckhart, I'm a professional show jumper representing France, and I'm Lola's mom. Be mindful, be present, turn on your brain. The horse, the ultimate athlete, the best friend, the teammate. Once wild, they now place their unquestioning trust in us, in the ring, on the track, and in the field. At Keyflo, we hold a deep appreciation that horses choose to grant us humans the privilege to keep and to care for them. This sense of responsibility drives everything we do. We know that through health comes performance. So if we want their best, we've got to give them ours. Our mission to redefine equine nutrition began because there was a clear gap between what was available and what we knew was possible. We knew horse feed could be better, so we made it better. Better for those who need power and endurance to fuel performance. Better for those who need the best start in life to reach their potential. Better for those who seek marginal gains to reign supreme. Better for those who need the vitality to tackle new adventures. And better for those who seek longevity because they have more wisdom yet to share. 
through science and innovation we've developed a range of feeds that are easier for horses to digest that deliver more nutrients and that require lower feeding rates we've engineered each steam extruded nugget pallet cooked grain and drop of oil for the health of the horse so with every feed you can trust that you're doing your very best for them Tifo feeds redefining equine nutrition because horses rely on us. Jump off upcoming for today's $140,000 Bainbridge Company's three star Grand Prix. Jump off course beginning at the same first fence for round one that's in Elite Equestrian Ox. Uh, the left hand turn around the palm tree to the wall at two and turning right to a fence knot and play in round one. The brain juice at vertical at 15. Right hand turn from there to the Florida Coast Equipment Ox are at eight with the orange trails and turning left on the graph to the Remnants of the triple combination at 12, uh, the Bainbridge vertical at A, and the Oxer at B. Left hand turn from there to the purple, Oxer at 16, new fence for the jump off round, and then turning right from there to finish over the palm tree vertical at 5B. 16 to jump off today. The USA's Michael Morrissey will be our first to back for the jump off round here this afternoon. It's with Ilton Center Mel, owned by Stormridge Capital and Imperial Show Stables.
for the jump off at number 16 for Michael Morris. He holds on center mill at the time 40.57. Second on course for the jump off round, the Irishman Max Watchman with Gil Kenny, owned by Susan Magnier. Okay, clear over the jump off course, 38.80. The time for Ireland's Max Watchman with Kill Kitty. We have clear time to beat as Ireland's Christian Coyle comes up next in the callback quarter with Extravaganza Simi, owned by Alexis Bodum. 38.0, the time to beat. Steady and clear over the jump off course for Christian Coyle with Extravaganza Simi, owned by Alexis Bodo, the top 44 35. Fourth in the jump off order, Vanessa Hood, the U.S. rider aboard Cascal Rato, owned by Take Two LLC. The time to beat is 38 80, set by Max Watchman with Kilkin. Thirty-nine ninety-four. It's clear for Vanessa Hood with take two. Zikas Colorado goes into second place. Best point in the jump off round. Thirty-eight eighty. Still the time to beat. Uh, posted by Max Watchman with Kilkenny. <laughs> Ireland's Paulo Shea now with Squirt Gun, owned by Eye Candy Jumpers, chasing that time at thirty-eight eighty. Set by Ireland's Ma Max Watchman with Kilkenny.
37.94, quick time, but eight in the jump off with the last two fences over the jump off course coming down 16 and 5B for Ireland's follow Shea yeah, with the eye candy jumpers entry squirt gun. Again, we'll go back to back with the Irish in the jump off round. Dermot Lennon now with Millview Sisser. 38.80, the time to beat. Thirty-nine twenty-three. It's just off the pace by four tenths of a second. That will go into second for the Irishman Dermot Lennon with Millview Cicero. So it's one-two for the Irish currently. Max Watchman keeps the lead with Kilkenny. Dermot Lennon in second with Millview Cicero. Vanessa Hood third currently with Casas Colorado. And Brazil's Victor Mariano Luminati first of ten remaining for the jump off this afternoon. Cheering for ML Wellington Farm with Edet. Time to catch us 38 8 0. Or in the jump off at 12B, uh, just the knockdown at the Bainbridge Oxer for Victor Mariano Illuminati with the death. It's on 39-25. Quicker of the two fours in the jump off at this point into fifth place for the Brazilian rider. <laughs> Egypt's now in the SAR up next in the jump off round. Partnered with Capital Night Star, owned by Evergate Stables. Time to beat is 38.80, hosted by Max Watchman and Kilkenny. Thirty-nine ninety-three. It's clear and good enough for third at this point for Egypt's now this with Capital Knight Star. Still one-two for the Irish. Max Watchman leads with Kilkenny. Dermot Lennon second with Mildew Cicero. Egypt's now this are into third with Capital Knight Star. Next combination to challenge that time of thirty-eight eighty. The USA's Todd Minicus with Kickaboo Spirit, owned by the Spirit Group.
39-44 with four at five at B for Todd Medica's Kikaboo Spirit. Goes into seventh as the second fastest four. Falls here in the jump off at this point. Rider, please stand by one moment as we replace the broken fill there at 5B. At this point, Max Watchman in the lead with Gil Kinney. Dermot Lennon, Millview Cicero in second as Niall Nassar in third with Capital Knight Star. Vanessa Hood fourth with Gascoretto. Christian Coyle in fifth with Extrapta Simi. The top five all clear over the jump off course so far. Seven remaining to jump off. It's Anna Selick, and now the U.S. rider for Descanso Farm with Cloud 39. Again, the time to beat is 38.87. Max Watchman with Kilkenny. New leader there at 38.53, the USA's Hannah Selick with Cloud 39, owned by Descanso Farm. Max Watchman now into second at 38.80. As the U.S. rider comes in about three tenths of a second quicker, Dermot Lennon drops to third with Millview Cicero. Niall Nassar and Vanessa Hood rounding out the top five. Six still on the list for the jump off. And today's Bainbridge Company's three-star Grand Prix. Venezuela's Luis Fernando Lara Tzabal now for Jason Gatti with Bell Demuse. Getting that new time to beat at 38.53, just set by Hannah Selle with Cloud 39. Lead changing hands at 37.68. Now the time to beat is Venezuela's Luis Fernando Larazabal moves to the front of the pack. With Driss and Gatti's Bell Demuse. Anna Selick, lead only lasting for one round there, goes into second with Cloud 39. Max Watchman now third with Kilkenny with the Dermot Lennon and Niall Nassar rounding out the top five. First to five remaining in the callback order, Mexico's a. Eugenio Garza for El Milagro with Contago. Thirty-seven sixty-eight is the time to catch.
Buckler jump off round, 39-13. The time for Eugenio Garza and Dakota Taco. Currently fourth with four remaining in the jump off round this afternoon. Luis Fernando Lanotombo leads Hannah Selleck second. Max Watchman third. It's fourth now for Mexico's Eugenio Garza. First of four, Chloe Reed and crossover four owned by Team Reed LLC. Chasing that time of 37.68 set by Venezuela's Luis Fernando Larazapo with Belle de Muse. Double clear today for Chloe Reed and crossover four, 41.96. The jump off time goes into eighth place for the U.S. Rider with the Team Reed LLC entry. Next to challenge to the USA's Mia Bagnato with the Alon Farms at Balioskill Big Bucks. Time to beat at 37.68. Uh, the stop and the jump off at the wall in 10 on the clock. A uh, total of 14 over the jump off course. The time 62.25 for Mia Bagnato with Balio Skill Big Bucks. First of two remaining for the jump off, the USA's Andrew Wells with Idol H&H &H showing about the Atask Group and Evergreen Stables. Leading time 37-68, set by Venezuela's Luis Fernando Larazabo with Bell de Muse.
Yeah, four in the jump off at the Florida Coast Equipment Oxer at eight. The time 38.87 for Andrew Wells with Idle H&H &H going into 10th with one remaining. Two big wins this week already. The $32,000 two-phase Thursday, the qualifier Friday, attempting to make it three here with El Balu Old. It's Ireland's David O'Brien. 37.68, the time to beat. What a week for David O'Brien. Third big win at the top call today with El Balu Old. Clear over the jump off course at 37-17 for the Irishman with the entry owned by the Chansonet and Leapier Farms. It's going to be a second place finish for Venezuela's Luis Fernando Lado Samba with Belle Demus. Hannah Selleck third with Cloud9, the top three to return for presentation here in just a moment. Fourth place honors today going to Max Watchman with Kilkenny owned by Susan Magnier. Mexico's Eugenio Garza fifth for El Milagro with Contago. Irishman Dermot Lennon sixth with his own Millview Cicero. Egypt's Nile Nassar seventh aboard a Capital Night Star owned by Evergate Stables. Eighth place honors today going to Vanessa Hood riding for Take Two LLC with Casco Loretto. Chloe Reed ninth with Team Reed's crossover four. Tenth award goes to Christian Quill for Alexis Bodo with Extravaganza Semi. Fastest four falter, finishing 11th. Andrew Wells with Idle H&H, &H, owned by the Atasca Group and Evergreen Stables. And we'll round out the ribbons in 12th with Brazil's Victor Mariano Luminati with Iret, owned by ML Wellington Farm. Bainbridge is a fully integrated family of real estate companies who have developed and acquired more than 43,000 units representing $7.5 billion in transactions since inception. With over 650 associates nationally, Bainbridge engages in virtually every step of the real estate process, from development and construction, acquisition and disposition, to asset management and third-party property management of multifamily real estate Bainbridge is the 10th largest multifamily developer and the 14th largest multifamily builder in the United States. Our team of experienced and knowledgeable professionals is devoted to creating exceptional living experiences for all of our residents and building lasting, mutually beneficial relationships with our partners and clients. To learn more, visit www.bainbridgecompanies.com.
All right, top three returning on horseback for the presentation portion in today's $140,000 three-star Grand Prix. Making their way to the Bainbridge Companies Combination title sponsor for today's $140,000 competition. Bainbridge Companies is proud to be a sponsor of the 2024 Equestrian Sport Productions Annual Show Series. Based here in Wellington with offices in Orlando, Tampa, Washington, D.C., Charlotte, Raleigh, Atlanta, Dallas, and Austin. Bainbridge is one of the nation's premier owners, developers, builders, and managers of multifamily real estate. Richard Schechter, chairman and CEO of the Bainbridge Companies, presenting to our top three. Congratulations to our third place rider here this afternoon, Hannah Stick for the U.S. at third place honors aboard Cloud 39, owned by Descanso Farm. Second place photos of Venezuela's Luis Fernando Larazabal, the leading rider in the jump off until our final combination. Ultimately picking up the red rosette for his efforts here this afternoon. Riding for Dresen Gatti, the Venezuelan Luis Fernando Larazabo in second with Belle de Muse. Hey, congratulations to David O'Brien, his third big win on the grass this week. The top call in the $32,000 two-phase on Thursday. Winner of the $32,000 qualifier on Friday, and now the win in today's Bainbridge Company's Grand Prix with El Balu Old, owned by the Chansonette and the Leap Year Farms. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, we ask that you please rise if you are able and remove cover for the Irish National Anthem in honor of today's three-star winner, David O'Brien. Congratulations again to David O'Brien, big winner this week on the grass. His third top call in our FBI competitions. The win today with El Balu Old for the Irishman. 